pitch to the gate of heaven or hell. On the new Friday, he has to work. But on the weekend, he's a barber's shirt. The Death Show is brought to you by That's Right, That's Right, Everyone is Using It, How Do You Use It? Hello, I'm Harry Harbinger. You may know me as Death. In the 17th century, John Donne, a famous poet, once wrote, Death be not proud, for thou art not so. Well. I am certainly not proud these days. Why? Because I have seen too many neighborhoods cluttered with so much trash and debris that it becomes difficult, if not impossible, for business invitees such as myself to gain safe entry on and off of your property. The problem only gets worse, because each year the death toll continues to increase dramatically. I mean, there's the baby boomer generation finally dying off, compounded by increasing natural disasters, incurable illness, and frequent viewing of the Lifetime Channel. By last year alone, I personally ushered over 2 million people into the great beyond, and I still receive the same salary and the same expense account as if I had processed only half that amount. And just like you, I have to deal with the rising costs of energy, rental housing, and put up with traffic gridlock, plane cancellations, and Barbara Streisand. Oh man, I just can't wait until she makes the list. But I digress. Look, let's be honest with each other. I know you don't really want to see me, and guess what? I don't really want to see you either. But just like all of humanity, when it becomes your time to leave this world, you and I will be forced to meet face to face. Unless, of course, your face gets torn off in some kind of horrible accident. Hey, that's what happened to me. Anywho, to make the process of dying easier on all of us, there are a few things you can do to help. For example, keep all walkways in front and behind your home clear of debris and obstructions. This will make it faster for me to get in and out of your home. Don't eat a big meal before you pass away and wear light clothing. That way you will be easier to transport. Lastly, it would really help if everyone out there could worship the same God. This will significantly cut down on the amount of paperwork and streamline shipping costs. Okay, thank you for listening. Well, now I'm off to my second job, filling in for the Tooth Fairy who somehow gets to go on vacation, even though I'm the one that's been asking for decades. Okay, there you go. Hey, I'm really going to get a lot done with these things. Okay, don't do anything creepy with my wings. Just because I'm deaf doesn't mean I'm gonna do something creepy with them. Say it. Don't. I won't use your wings to tickle the sea nymphs. Good, because I want them in perfect working order when I get back. You mean, if you get back. <laughs> <laughs> Oh,